So the story is super familiar. I hear it all the time. Men start serving in their local brigade unit because they want to serve boys or young men. Turns out what ends up happening is they begin to grow as men. They begin to grow as husbands. They begin to grow as fathers. They begin to grow as friends. Friendships develop that they never even thought were possible. And it turns out that what they were intending to be a blessing to others becomes a blessing to themselves. I think that's the way that God has designed the world. I'll give you an example from personal experience, actually from this morning. I was on the phone with a young man who we speak every Friday. He's a young man who attends our church, but I would not have the kind of relationship with him were it not for our presence together in Christian Service Brigade. It provided a context where we could actually build relationship with one another. We were talking about a number of things, including the memory verse that we're working on for our upcoming event. It's a big passage, 2 Corinthians 4, verses 1 through 15. And he was telling me that one of the things that's motivating him is a healthy rivalry between he, who's 20, and a 60-year-old man in our congregation who also attends our battalion. This is a relationship that never would have never would have existed were it not for Christian Service Brigade and its presence in our church. It's not just a healthy rivalry, it's actually a growing friendship. Um, they're both able to learn and be challenged in godly ways that never would have happened were it not for the context that Christian Service Brigade provides. I think you'll probably agree from your own experience that building discipleship relationships is not something that we are normally good at. It's something that we need to be shown how to do. It's something that we need to experience in order to really see the benefit of it. That's exactly what Christian Service Brigade is doing. It's from the time a boy is little and through his adolescence, training him that to be a part of the Christian community, to be a Christian man, means that you're in relationships with other men. It means that you're serving. It means that you're being open. It means that you're receiving counsel. It means that you're looking up toward those men who are older and from whom you can learn. It means that you're looking down at the, the, the people who are younger than you or weaker than you or less mature than you and finding ways to serve. We're actually cultivating a healthy company of men who can then go on to be productive in men's ministry and in serving in the Christian church. Not a new concept for Christian Service Brigade. In fact, there's an old slogan. I think we might have borrowed it from somebody historical, but it's, it's better to build healthy boys than to repair broken men. You see, what we're doing now as we invest in this next generation, cultivating boys and young men with this vision of them becoming adult, healthy men, we're actually preparing men to be a part of the local church in various ways, including men's ministry, but preparing them in such a way that they're actually entering into that company of men healthy rather than broken.